The Senate Bill 693. Discussion. Representative McDermott. Speaker, thank you. I rise in opposition. Opposition, please proceed. Mr. Speaker, as Yogi Berra said, this is deja vu all over again. Mr. Speaker, uh, I was here with some of the other members when we did the van camps, and we all thought it was a great idea. Understanding these are not van camps, they're stationary. Uh, but that is, the van, the fact that it was mobile, that is one objection, but the, the Jason Bourne-like quality of being looked at by Big Brother is what people object to. It's, it, it just goes against their interests as uh, freedom-loving people. Mr. Speaker, I don't like speeding. I don't like running red lights. I don't think it's good at all. And anything we can do to deter that is wonderful. But this crosses the line, it's gonna be intrusive. Now, <clears throat> what will happen is, and I'm putting my uh, Nostradamus hat on again, Mr. Speaker. Perry and Price are gonna come on one Monday morning. Well, red light cams are up and these are the areas, boom, boom, boom. So let's talk about the areas that they're gonna be affected. Two of them are on a street Fort Weaver Road, which boundaries my district, and I share that road with my Kababayan from Eva Beach. We share that road, Fort Weaver Road. We both voted against this in committee. Now, Mr. Speaker, this affects both of us. Now, I'm speaking for myself, but Fort Weaver is the main thoroughfare down to Eva Beach, and I live all the way inside. I drive it every day, back and forth, and based on anecdotal observations where I've spent literally hundreds of hours out there waving signs, I don't see a lot of red light running because it is almost a semi-freeway, so you have longer yellows, okay? So structurally, it's not set up where you would have that sort of problem uh, anyway. But my concern is why do I have two, two, not one, two out of five throughout the state, two in my district, and I didn't ask for them, and I don't want them. And then in the committee report, we're here, well, we'd like to add another one, uh, Vineyard and Punchbowl. You don't have to add another one, Mr. Speaker. You can have one of mine. I don't want either of them, honest to God. And I share that with the chair. But for some reason, I got stuck with them. So I would ask, as this goes on to finance, and I read the committee report, it seems like a lukewarm uh, endorsement of the me measure, but I would ask that at least please heed my suggestion, I don't want them, because I know what's gonna happen. The phone is gonna blow up. Not because people got mad because they got dinged with speeding, they just don't like the big brother quality. If a policeman's there and he tags you, that's fine. And then I'd like to point out that the revenue goes straight to the general fund. So is this a money-making opportunity? I don't know. All that being said, Mr. Speaker, I do not condone speeding. Safety is very important. But I don't like the way we're doing this. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mayor.